The average typing speed is about 40 words per minute. Using the right tools and methods can double or even triple that speed, save time and leave more room for creativity. Hi, my name is Guy and I'm going to show you 5 ways to speed up your typing and be more productive. Let's begin. Tip number one, use predictive typing. Predictive typing solutions for PC keyboards are way different than what we currently have on our mobile phones. Instead of selecting between multiple word options after each tap on the screen, predictive typing solutions offer just a single suggestion based on confidence. If you combine that with sophisticated AI prediction technology, you can give a great boost to your typing speed and overall productivity. Now, there are currently two main predictive typing solutions out there. The first one is Google Smart Compose, a built-in predictive typing feature for Gmail that can help you write your emails faster. Once activated, Smart Compose will show you word or phrase suggestions as you type, and if you want to accept a suggestion, simply use the right arrow key. One small thing though, Smart Compose relies on internet connectivity, so if you are on a flight without a Wi-Fi connection or in some other disconnected environment, you won't get any predictions. The next predictive typing solution is LightKey, a Windows software that is designed not only to help you write your emails faster, but also your documents, presentations, and basically any kind of content ranging from casual to professional in over 80 languages. Once installed, LightKey will show you word, phrase, or even sentence suggestions as you type, and if you want to accept a suggestion, simply hit on tab, which is the default option, or use the enter key instead. In terms of privacy, LightKey does not submit any of your content to the cloud and it does not rely on internet connectivity whatsoever, so you don't need to be worried whether you are online or not when you're working on your content. The second tip is to take a free online touch typing course. The basic idea of touch typing is being able to type while staying focused on the screen so you won't need to look at the keyboard. Otherwise, moving your visual focus between the keyboard and the screen will slow things down and if this is the case for you, learning touch typing can give a major boost to your typing speed and overall productivity. Now, there are plenty of online courses that you can take and my favorite one is Typing Club. They have a super friendly and intuitive course that starts off by teaching you simple key combinations and then it will add more keys to the mix until eventually you will master the entire keyboard and be able to stay focused on the screen while typing. However, if you are looking to learn touch typing in a different way, perhaps a more fun and exciting way, the next item is just for you. Tip number three, play online touch typing games. There are plenty of free online games to choose from and some of them will even let you set the level of difficulty or the keyboard area that you want to practice on. After doing some research and playing some online games, my favorites are Car Rider, Keyboard Ninja and Type For Your Life. And if you want to try them out, you can find their links in the video description. And of course, you are welcome to try more online games if you want, just google typing games and see where it takes you. Have fun! Tip number four, switch to a split keyboard. This is a very important and personal topic for me because I've had years in my life where I've typed like 10 hours a day without giving too much thought to ergonomics and as a result, typing became fairly uncomfortable and I just felt frustrated and less productive throughout my day. So after doing some research and learning about ergonomics, I found the concept of split keyboards to be an amazing solution to my problem because that physical split has two main advantages. The first one is that I was able to work for long periods of time without feeling any wrist pain and that by itself made me more productive. The second advantage is that the physical split helped me better understand the mapping between my hands and the keys and as a result it improved my typing accuracy and my typing speed as well. Now, I can totally understand that getting used to a new keyboard, let alone a split keyboard, will take its time, but I also believe that in the long term it will be totally worth it because it will keep your wrists healthy and it will improve your typing skills as well.
Tip number five, use dictation. We speak three times faster than we type, which basically means that properly using dictation can help us write our content three times faster. However, dictation is not always the optimal choice, so here are a few guidelines whether or not to choose dictation over typing. First, make sure that you have a clear understanding of the content you're trying to create. In other words, make sure that you have a well-baked idea in your head and all you want is just to speed it out on your PC. Next, make sure that you are in a dictation-friendly environment, which basically means that you are in a place with low background noise so that the dictation software will be able to understand you and you will be able to stay focused during the process. And last, make sure that you feel comfortable speaking your thoughts in the target language, especially if it's not your native language. So given that you have a well-baked idea, you are in a dictation-friendly environment, and you feel comfortable speaking your thoughts in the target language, dictation can be a great way for you to write your content faster. So here are a few dictation tools that you can use for free. Windows 10 has a great built-in dictation feature that you can activate using WinKey and H. And once activated, just start talking and you will see how your words are being written on the screen. Similarly, Google has a great dictation feature for Google Docs that you can activate by going to Tools, Voice Typing, and then clicking on the microphone icon. And once activated, again, just start talking and you will see how your words are being written on the screen. The last tip, which is our bonus tip for today, is to experiment with text generation. The basic idea of text generation is that you can take a piece of text, feed it into an AI-powered engine, and then it will write the rest of the text for you. And as futuristic as it sounds, today we are starting to see some interesting results using text generation engines, and the most famous one is GPT-2 by OpenAI. If you want to see GPT-2 in action, there is a website called talktotransformer.com and as an example, I've taken a few sentences from the beginning of this video, fed it into the website and the results, let's say, are pretty interesting. Okay, we have reached the end of this video. Please let me know in the comment section what is your favorite way to speed up your typing and be more productive. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to learn more about how technology can transform your productivity. See you in the next video. Bye bye. And if, <clears throat> however, if you are looking for a more, now I can, so that the dictation soft, so the dictation software can have fun.